euh, offert par les partenaires notamment. Allez, euh, eh bien, euh, Chiludou Rita Rosa, voilà, allez, venez nous voir. Voilà, fondatrice de Wines, ou Vines, je sais pas comment on dit, Wines by Rosa. Les opportunités dans le secteur des vins et des spiritueux. Voilà, qu'est-ce que vous voulez nous dire, vous qui travaillez pas mal avec euh, euh, des, des châteaux français pour euh, vendre, euh, vendre au, au Nigeria Qu'est-ce que vous voulez nous dire Hello, everybody. So they save the best for last, as <laughs> usual. Um, the wine business, as you all would know, is a wine. It's a business of passion, of love, of enjoyment. So I just want to make this appeal to everybody here who is French and who doesn't know how amazing Nigeria is. You can do good business in Nigeria. You can do amazing business in Nigeria. And I'm very proud of my partners, who you'll be seeing outside. Nigeria is a, is, a com is a country with a population that is explosive mm -hmm. and is going to continue being explosive. And not just that, we are talking about people who are educated, who are well-traveled, who know what they are looking for, so they know good quality. And I know France. Imagine, I'm the black woman in the wine world, so I can tell you for sure, we know what we like, we know what we want, and we know good quality, and we know France brings good quality. So if you have any aim to do business, Nigeria is the place to be. Like my dear sir said, if you're not in Nigeria, you're not in Africa. Never forget that. Because doing business in Africa means doing business in Nigeria. If you have a good partner, and this is what we're talking about. Today it has been about partnership, partnership, partnership. Finding the right partnership gives you a straight way to success in Nigeria. You have to get the right partners. You have to work with the right partners. There has to be trust and there has to be mutual benefit. Nigeria has the capability to entertain and unencompress your business and make good profit. Mm -hmm. There is good business to be done. There are more than 60% 60, 60 during the COVID, everywhere in the world, people were crying. Oh, the hospitality business is dying, is trembling. But in Nigeria, in less than two months, there was a 60% increase in restaurants 60 percent it's nowhere else in the world there were restaurants opening every week imagine restaurants opening every week what does that mean more wines going into nigeria and as you can hear from um monsieur <laughs> thank you for that very good news because our wine importers and partners our biggest problem has always been how do we get our products into Nigeria fast enough without this even a little bit of uh, displacement of the integrity of our products? Champagne going into Nigeria has to remain the same taste, flavor, beauty as it is here in France and when it gets to Nigeria. We know quality. We know when the wine is cooked. We know when the wine is not tasting the way it should. Mm -hmm. Please remember, education is a key. For Nigerians, we want partners who want to come and invest. How, El big, how big is the market, the, oh. the wine market? Tell me. You have some figures. Huh. Figures, I have told people I don't do figures. I do visual. You have to come to Nigeria to see. Because I know a lot of my clients who have never been to Nigeria. And the first time, I have a client who just came back from Nigeria. He's, he's over the moon. He's never been to Nigeria. He's used to the Francophone countries. But I promise you, when you step into Nigeria, the heat will hit you first. Huh? Boom. That's the first thing you will feel. You'll say to yourself, oh my God.